Hey, what's up? Adam Force here, co-founder at Change Creator. Um, if there's one ingredient that I've noticed over the years for myself, um, the people around me, uh, and all the entrepreneurs that we work with and Captivate and at Change Creator, uh, if it's missing, you're just never going to find what you're looking for in life, which is however you define success, right? And to me, that really becomes down to living something that is fulfilling to you. And that ingredient is heart. Um, and that might sound like, Adam, what are you talking about? Um, I remember when I was younger, I was facing uh, an interesting opportunity that fell uh, in front of me, and that was to participate uh, on Team New Jersey for the Nationals, Freestyle Wrestling Nationals, um, which meant a road, a long road of a lot of hard work with Team New Jersey to really become qualified and as strong as possible to compete in the national tournament. At the time, it was going to be in North Dakota. Um, and as I, this was towards later in my wrestling career, I wrestled for about 10 years. And, you know, I remember going through all these, pra like two practices a day, and one of them would be at our school, uh, and another would be um, at a, a, a camp we would do for a week, or later in another area down an hour drive away. And I was doing so much at the time. I would wake up and run four miles every day, go to two wrestling practice days. Like, you know, we were getting hammered, and, and you're competing and practicing with the best of the best of the best, which means, you know, it's, it's it's just never easy. It's just really tough, right? Um, so best shape of my life, strongest I've ever been, and you know, feeling good. Um, and I loved all that, um, the idea of all that, right? But there was something that was missing for me. Um, and as I was getting older, I had less heart um, as a competitor in that sport and more distractions in my life that were pulling me away. And I... I, I didn't know it at the time that my heart wasn't quite there. Um, but what happened was despite all the hard work and s despite being one of the best, the top uh, wrestler in the state and like all that kind of stuff, what I found out the hard way was if your heart's not in it, you're going to get your ass kicked anyway. <laughs> you know, so I went to the nationals and it was this huge like gymnasium just all the top competitors around the country and you know I got into my first match and what happened was I was kicking his butt right and I think I have this on video and I was up by I don't know double digit points and the next thing you know I just ran out of gas and it's not because I was out of shape it's not because I was too tired it was mental fatigue due to not having enough heart in it. And if your heart's not in it, it's easy to emotionally punk out. And so whether it's wrestling or it's you know running a business on your own or doing something else incredible in your life, if your heart's not in it, it's going to make it really difficult, if not impossible, to actually get where you want to go and succeed. So we can't fool ourselves. We want to believe in ourselves and we got to have heart and passion for what we're doing because that gives you the willpower and the drive to push through when things get really, really tough.